A little while ago, I made a video about the Devolo Wi-Fi Mesh Whole Home Kit, and it was actually a very good upgrade for me, boosting the performance of my Virgin Media router to the point where I could get very good internet anywhere on my property, even down the bottom of my garden, which is really handy now that our two weeks of summer is here. I've been using it for the last few months and I am very happy with it. It hasn't let me down at all, but now Devolo have asked me to try another one of their products. Hi everyone, I'm David for Pocketlint and this is the Devolo Magic 2 Wi-Fi Next Whole Home Kit, the world's fastest adapter with max Wi-Fi speeds of 1,200 megabits per second and max power line speeds of double that at 2,400 megabits per second. So what do I mean by power line speeds? Well, just like the Devolo Mesh Wi-Fi 2, which is the product I currently have installed, the system plugs into your regular household socket and uses the power lines in your walls to transmit the signal from your router to wherever you place the two supplied adapters, essentially giving your signal a proper pathway through the walls without losing signal strength. These adapters will provide you with hard Wi-Fi access points for you to connect an Ethernet cable and enjoy that power line speed, as well as a Wi-Fi signal that will be just as strong as the signal that you get while you're standing next to your main router. The product I have here is the whole home kit, which comes with one main unit, which will connect to your main router and two power adapters to dot around the house. This one will set you back 269 pounds, but a kit with one main unit and one single adapter is available for 169 pounds, with extra adapters going for 109. At first, I thought that it is quite a pricey product. I even said that in my review about the Mesh Kit 2, which cost a little bit more at £299, but I have come to realize that these are really high quality products and they're worth each and every penny. They're designed and engineered in Germany with a three year manufacturer guarantee. Devolo certainly have got confidence in the quality of this product. And as I've mentioned before, I've had zero problems with it, none at all. I haven't needed to reset the system once or even adjust the settings through the app. Nothing, it's just been as good as gold, running 24 seven solid. If you have a very fast Wi-Fi service, then the chances are that the range of that super fast signal is not really that impressive. I found this out a while ago when I upgraded my Virgin Media router. Virgin gave me speeds of up to 350 megabits per second, and those speeds were only really achievable while standing a max of six feet away from the router. And it would drop off really quickly after that, to the extent that only part of the house had any coverage. The Devolo kit that I reviewed a few months back, the Mesh 2 Whole Home Kit, did solve that problem. And this is a very similar product to the Magic 2 Whole Home Kit, in both the way it looks and how it works. The only visual differences between the two are the markings on the top right, and the Magic adapter is slightly smaller than the Mesh Kit. But the extender units are exactly the same in both kits and are interchangeable, meaning that you can use the Magic extenders with the Mesh Kit and vice versa. But there are some crucial hardware differences that might make you want to go for one over the other. The main difference is that the Mesh Kit is designed to replace your modem's Wi-Fi functions. Part of its setup is for you to switch off Wi-Fi on your router. So it's recommended if you have an older or a stock router supplied to you by your service provider and you're not really happy with it. The new Magic Kit is designed to work with your router's Wi-Fi. So it's better to go for this one if you've bought yourself a high powered modern router and you want to maximize its potential. These units feature multi-user MIMO technology, which optimizes the signal to all the access points and ensures a smooth connection despite the amount of devices connected. With the original mesh kit, Devolo say that you can have up to 100 devices connected at a time, but there is no limit specified with the Magic Kit. They just say you can have as many as you like. Another feature is access point steering. Normally it is your device that decides when the signal it's receiving is too weak, and then it will decide whether it wants to switch to another network or start to search for another network. Older devices wait until the signal is interrupted before they start looking for another option. The Devolo Magic 2 will form a Wi-Fi mesh together with your router, and it will constantly switch between the access points without you noticing. Setting up the device is really straightforward, so much so that you might think that you've missed something as most of it does happen automatically. It is all explained in very easy to understand one sentence steps with diagrams, and it can be done without downloading anything. But I do recommend that you download the Devolo Home Network app. Just either go to the Apple's App Store or Google Play Store and search Devolo. Once you've done that, copy down the password from one of the units, then plug the two extender adapters wherever you'd like them to be in the house and turn them on. After a maximum of one minute, you should see the house icon start to flash white quickly. 
You then plug in the main adapter and connect it to your router using the supplied Ethernet cable. The system will start automatically pairing and after a maximum of three minutes, all of the lights will be solid white and you will see the new Wi-Fi network is available to you. That's the basic installation, but for the best coverage, there is a slightly different installation method that will include your original router and create a truly seamless Wi-Fi mesh over a large area. This is done by transferring the Wi-Fi key and network password from your router to your Magic Adapter and it will give you a better overall coverage. If you've already installed it using the previous method and you want to switch to include your router for the best coverage, then I recommend you hard reset all of the adapters. This can be done by holding down the house icon button for five seconds. In fact, if you've had any problems at all, I would recommend doing this and then going for a nice clean install. Once everything is reset, then take one of the extended adapters and plug it into a wall socket that's within 10 meters of the router and where you're going to plug in the main adapter. Wait for about one minute until the house icon LED lights up white. Now briefly press that white house icon button and it should start flashing. You now have two minutes to press the WPS button on your router. There's only one button on my router and I have to hold it for two seconds to engage WPS. Now just wait for the LEDs on all of the adapters to light up solid white and the installation is complete. You can then unplug the adapter and place it wherever you want to put it in the house. And now your router will be working together with the adapters to provide one seamless mesh. There are some tools within the app to help you do all of this. If you do get stuck, I suggest you go into the app, select one of the adapters and then use the Wi-Fi clone tool to copy your network password directly onto the adapter. Just click start and then go ahead and push the WPS button on your modem and it should automatically happen. Do this for both of the adapters and then you will have one seamless mesh. For me, this is definitely the way to go because you end up with just one network to connect to, which is your original network. And all of your devices will automatically connect to it like you haven't changed a thing. When it comes to the performance, I'm looking at about 200 megabits per second anywhere that I go in the house. Now, that goes up a little bit if I'm a little bit closer to one of the adapters, but I would say on average, it is roughly about 200 megabits anywhere, upstairs or downstairs. Where I am here is at the back of the garden or at the bottom of the garden, and obviously speeds drop off a little bit, but I'm still looking at 70 megabits per second, which is still plenty fast, fast enough to stream HD video or play games or pretty much do anything on the internet. So not bad. So that was the Devolo Magic 2 Wi-Fi Next Whole Home Kit. It's definitely worth the investment as it is something that you can easily take with you if you decide to move house and it is guaranteed to give you good coverage with your Wi-Fi. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you found this useful. Don't forget to leave us a thumbs up and a subscribe if you did and I'll see you in the next video.